Welcome to the barn. Thank you very much for everybody watching, liking, and subscribing. As I said before, without you guys, we wouldn't be doing what we do and being able to present it to you on here. Now, we do buy and sell cars on consignment, and today we have on consignment this beautiful, beautiful, beautiful black R32. Now, do you remember these when you were a kid? Of course you do. I'm 40. I'm actually 40 this week. I remember these like rolling around my hood. And you're thinking, my God, man, these things are so cool. And it's called nostalgia. As we roll through, as we're coming to age now, we're able to afford these things. Back in the day, we weren't. Then they went through a stage of not being worth a lot of money. Then they were like quite rubbish because people just abused them. But now we're getting to the age where we're, we've got a little bit of pocket change and we can finally afford to buy something like this. Now, this is the one. If you're looking for an R32 and you think, I got a bit of money, I'm looking to invest some, in something into something instead of putting it into the bank. And yes, I want to relive my youth. Well, have I got news for you. This is now a for sale. And this is a beautiful, beautiful thing. This is a very, very, very nice car. 65,000 miles. The owner that has it presently is a massive fan. He bought it because he wanted one since he was younger. He could finally afford one. Now he's bought one. He now wants to go into 911s. So he has to sell a couple of his cars to get one of those this being one of them. Believe me, he don't want to sell it, but he just knows that he ain't, it ain't possible to keep it whilst moving forward to buy this 911. So like now, one of you lucky guys could end up buying it and what a perler this thing is. It is modified and I have a list. I'm going to read off that list. Two seconds because, you know, I can't remember everything. It's a cute little list that the owner just wrote for me. So I'm going to read it out to you. Now, as you can see, it is immaculate. And yes, lots of people want these absolutely stock. But for me, there's stuff that can be done to improve them. And this thing has that done, right? So we're going to roll from the top. So we've got Porsche 996 brakes. They're cool. They're really cool. And they've been like powder coated this like yellow luminous color, which I really, really like. Audi R8 handbrake caliper, because it's got a separate handbrake caliper to the actual Porsche brake that's on there. That is also very cool. Powerflow exhaust, adjustable rear lower control arm. Very, very important on these when you lower them because it puts the toe out, they're a nightmare. That's a must, right? Rear windscreen wiper delete, a biggie, right? Is the Expel PPF. Now this car, the entire front end, is being PPF. I'll drop a little like video here of when I was watching it earlier. It's being PPF and ceramic coated by Ian Hawke and Hawke Detailings. That is not a cheap job. That was about 2,200 pounds. That's how much the owner loves this car, right? The, the water was running off it earlier. It only gets hand washed. It's in beautiful condition and it's purely down to the owner being obsessed with keeping this thing clean. It is gorgeous. It's got an extra cup holder and center console. Upgraded sound system. The sound system in this car is insane. It's got a sub and a boot. It's got like hidden speakers. It is like, it looks stock, but it is beautiful. It's got like a touchscreen little thing. It's, it's, it's lovely, right? The Coeing wind back seats. Now, these are my favorite. They're super, super comfy. And if you're looking for one of these, they are a must, right? What I'm gonna do now is, is grab my little camera and run you through this car quickly. Cause the rain is trying to set in and Wales's weather is ruining my life. Right, I'm gonna grab that camera now and I'm gonna run you around it quickly. Let's do this. And then we're gonna take it for a spin. <laughs> Honestly, the Welsh weather is ruining my life. Went to go get the camera, it started hammering down. Luckily, we got some Gucci B-roll and photos before the weather actually set in. But this, good, this is a good time to show you to the extent how well this thing's been looked after. Do you know when you have like a car, and if you're an enthusiast, which you probably are looking at the side, you're thinking, I wonder how well this thing's looked after. Look at this. Oh, the beating. That's right, folks. Look at that base job. And that's ceramic coated on top of the PPF, which is like incredible. So like when I say this car is immaculate, it is absolutely immaculate. It's in beautiful condition. Even the front bumper has this plate. And this plate and sticks. And it's got no holes. Like, how amazing is that? How fussy and amazing that? I, I mean, that goes to the extent um, that this car has been cared for. It's, it's, it's beautiful. So I'm going to stick this back on. Which has got magnets, so it sticks up. Oh, look at that. How clever is that? Right, okay. Okay, where do I start? First things first, I love R32s. 
this example is beautiful. And if I was looking to buy one myself, it would be black on black. In general, the condition of the car is just like, it's, it's incredible. I mean, obviously at this price point, you expect it to be beautiful, but it really, really is. I can't, I can't like express how nice this car is. And the short drive that I did drive it down here, it drove like absolutely perfect. The interior is like unbelievable. I hate using the term like new. Bear in mind now that this car is like 20, 20 years old. Like the bolsters, look how nice they are. And they haven't been like refurbished or anything. This is original and they are in beautiful condition. The interior in general, like someone's obviously redone the steering wheel. Beautifully stitched. That's so classy. I love, I love the fact that everything has been done in this car. Not shabby, it's, it's, it's beautiful. Pedals you've got there, it's got the golf bar mats and the interior in general. It's just insane. The silver the boot. Honestly, the sound system's ridiculous. And it's got this lovely, lovely sub in the back. Check it out. Very neat. Similar color to the matting and the carpeting around it. So it just sits and fits in lovely. As I said, everything about this car, OEM plus. There we are. That's the word I was looking for, OEM plus. It is beautiful. Like look at the little speakers in the door. Oh, let's take this little beauty for a spin and try and portray through video what this thing is like. I'm going to try my best. I tell you what's very cool though, the amount of attention it gets. I'm just rolling through traffic and there's loads of people giving like the thumbs up and stuff. And like, you'd be surprised, eh? like being black on black and so understated. You wouldn't have thought that people would take any notice of it, but like loads of people are. I, I, I didn't know. I'm surprised. We're going to get onto the bypass now and give it a little bit of the beans. Give you that glorious VR6-esque noise that these things are so famous for. They are, they sound so good. Six parts sound so great. And they don't sound like normal V6s, these sound a little bit offbeat. It sounds even cooler. <laughs> video is always better I mean we have got a ramp in our in our shop if you did want to come down and view this and you wanted to have a quick look underneath that is more than possible any inspections are welcome if you're looking at this from a review point of view oh. everything okay you sound in this one yes I'm literally doing the video now. It might not even be going up for sale because this guy sounds pretty interesting. He's just following me down. Right, any inspections are welcome. We do take part exchange. Delivery is no problem. As I said, we are selling this on consignment. So if you've got something special and you want to sell it, we do know what we're talking about. Drop us a message. Thank you very much for watching, guys. Have a great day.